Here's the Elliott Wave forecast for July 22nd, 2008. The NASDAQ futures are down about 30, 33 because of Apple's earnings. And uh, I was actually expecting um, sort of a C wave or downward three on earnings, and looks like we're going to get that. Anyway, um, 0.6 million support is around uh, 22, 27, 22, 30. It needs to hold that level. If you can't hold that level, there's a chance that it might drop to as low as 2170 and break 2170. Uh, for starters, though, I'll look at 2227, as support from the NASDAQ. All right, for S&P. The speed features are down about 12. So I expected a drop to around 1245 or 1250. And uh, it actually might get worse because of NASDAQ, because NASDAQ is down a lot. For the Dow, Dow doesn't look that bad. It doesn't look like the NASDAQ, but... um. It might test right now. It'll in the morning it's probably going to test eleven thousand three fifty, and because of Nasdaq's uh, drop, there's probably going to happen tomorrow morning with the big gap. Looks like the Dow might uh, drop further than that. So I'm guessing wave two is across the board for uh, at least minimum, because if Nasdaq can't hold twenty two twenty seven, it might turn into a downward three or down. And on the six month chart, that's a, it's probably going to be a fifth wave down. I'm guessing um, that, um, that what we saw here was a the rally, the recent rally in the past few days was probably upward four, and we're probably going to see a downward five this week. That's a wrap.